Are you folks? We are off on manoeuvres today, Sharon. We are. We're out and about. We are going to visit the uh, Travel Trolls and also Campsite Warden and JP and Sammy, all YouTubers. So come along with us it's for the ride. It is a meet up. Don't yeah. know what we don't know what's going to happen, folks. Not too sure what's going to happen. We just have to play it by ear. It's a little bit cold out today, so we have got our coats out the back. But um, if we go out somewhere, you're coming with us. So we we'll see you in a minute. So we make our way off now. We're going down to uh, Mumby in um, Lincolnshire, and uh, we're following Sharon Satnav on her car this time. And normally we use our phone, but um, as you can probably see now, it's taken us off the main route and decided to take us down some old country lanes or farm lanes or whatever, covered in mud. And she wasn't very happy because she just had her car cleaned. Anyway, we're nearly there now. Let's get back to the video. Well. Here we are, folks. We're at uh, the nursery's caravan site, I think it's called. Yeah, oh, it is, Neil. Look, here it is. He's over there. He's chatting. Of course, he's chatting. He's talking bubble, isn't he? Well, we're here, as I say, and they're, they're having a lot of work done here, shall So that's going to look a bit of a bomb site, folks. So uh, don't worry too much about the site. I'm sure by the summer it's going to look fantastic. Right, the gate's oh, here we go. How are you, Neil? I, I, heard, I heard you were you were you were paying a visit and everything. Happy, How are you? Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Oh, your hair's cold. Happy Look, you need a pair of gloves on. I'm a, I'm a hard man. Look, I've got to check it, check it on. Oh, I'm a hard man. He's a lumberjack. He's a lumberjack. Uh, I sang that the other day. Well, I know. We saw. We saw your yeah, video. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Where are we parking? Straight so, down there. You, you, well, you've got a choice because obviously we've got a lot of building work going on. Of course you have. Um, where the black car is in front of you there. Yep. Just before it, after the tractor, there is a bit of a run in. You'll see it after a bit. I'll walk you down. Come down there. Let me get this camera. All right. All right. No ah. worries. I know where we're going. Look at all this work they're doing here, folks. Look. Yeah, look, these are up for sale. Aren't yeah, they? they've got the old lodges there, which they're. This is what it's all about. They're putting new lodges in. Oh, I'll show you. Just cleaned your car, baby. Look. I know. Filthy. Let's wait for it to turn up. They said he wanted to walk us in. We're letting walk us in. See, folks. that was what he was on about, weren't you, the other what? day? Why haven't the British caravan's got a slider? And there's one there, look. Yeah, I know, yeah. It's a little bit boggy, Neil. <laughs> uh, listen. Two weeks time. Go on. This will be dressed. The stone will be down. Of course and, it will. And, and the turf will be going down. It'll look amazing. Keep going, dear. I've come with me. There's one I'll follow you. We're following, look. He's the boss. I should, I should go through because of that puddle. Look, I should splash him. That's nasty. Of course got it cold is. Hands as it is. He's got cold hands, yeah. Yeah. He don't need wet legs. Of course he ain't. Mind you, he's got his wedding boots. Well, he'll, he'll park us somewhere nice. Just done him as you know you're here. Yeah, oh yes. Yeah, yeah, just park, park, park in front of the boat heads van there. Just, that, just in front of the boat just, heads. Just, just park in front of the boat heads. See you in a minute. Here he is. Desperate Dan. Oh, blinking out. Oh, boggy. Boggy, boggy. Here we go. Where's the gate? Where did we get in here? Hello. Oh, hello. Right, we're just having oh, a little yeah. workout where we're actually going there. Apparently, we're going to Skeggy and we've got another little visitor here. It's JP. Hey. Look, the three amigos, Sharon. Look. Three amigos. Hey? Wow. And apparently, we're going to They're Skeggy. Not musketeers, hey? sure. What's that, sir? You're not the three musketeers. Oh, charming. Unbelievable. See what I mean? They've started on the us three already. Stooges. Three stooges. Three uh, yeah. stooges. Hear no evil, see no evil, show. speak no evil. I'll, I'll tell uh, you what. Oh, here we go. I'm impressed with that camera. Go on, here we go. That's brilliant. Looking Face at tracking. the screen. You just told me it was crap. <laughs> Matt Ben and a GoPro. I was AGI as well. Oh, that of course that's quite super. nice. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm impressed with the screen. He's, in, yeah. he's, he's, uh, he's looking at my tackle here, folks, yeah. and uh, he seems to be quite happy with it. I'm going to grab all of some of the art. Anyway, they've had a bit of a, they've had a, bit of a think and a, 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 a collaborate. Uh, we're going to Skeggy, apparently, and the girls are doing one thing. What are you doing, girls? Charity shopping! Unbelievable! Charity! And we've got to sit in the car apparently. <laughs> no, we don't know. We'll meet you there anyway. We're going to pick up Sammy, which is uh, JP's other half. What about Raven? Is yeah, Raven he's coming. Is Raven's coming. Yeah. So uh, there'll be a dog there as well. So uh, it's a dog friendly zone, Sharon, isn't we it? We love dogs. We love dogs we as love well. Dogs. It's a dog friendly pub we're going to be eating. Oh, we're eating as well. The dog. And you've also oh, checked that they do a mixed grill because we're having a mixed grill, me and Sharon. I saw Mazzy says, I haven't yeah. checked the menu. Yeah, but we had nice. Christmas dinner then, it was very it. nice. It's right. spot on, yeah. Anyway, it. right, we're going to go, folks. We'll see you on the way. On stop me. arguing, girl, stop arguing. She's <laughs> trying to get me fat. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see you later. Bye for now. <laughs> trying to get me fat. 
Right, we different. just got in a car park, folks. It's four pound all day. This is the one round by the station, Sharon, isn't it? Yeah, the station's in front. And you can pay on the card, which I've never heard of before. There you go. I suppose everyone's got cards now, Sharon. They do it on their phones, don't they? So we're literally just across the road from the um, train station. I'll show you that in a second. Oh, hello. <laughs> Speed bumps. Speed bumps. There we go. That's the train station over there, and we've got this line. So. Hey, what's that? Yeah, we just—I was just saying—got a lovely retro shop here. Look. Look at this. Look at this, people. Look. There's some nice stuff in here. Hey, I'll show that. Do you, baby? Hey. Come on. Of course you do. Oh, you like the flowery dress, don't you? This is Sammy, by the way. That's JP's other half. And then, where's Raven? And there's old Raven, who's a lurcher, isn't ya? Hey, lovely lurcher. Right, we're, we're like tourists at the moment, folks, so uh, bear with us. We'll just ground ourselves, get where we are, and then we'll uh, come back to you. We'll see you in a minute. Right, so we're just walking down what used to be known as, I think it was Chip Pan Alley, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Where have you got that and, from? <laughs> probably the, the host of chip shops that's here. And that where it says Chip Pan Alley? I never even saw it. You know what, JP, I've never even seen that. After all the years I've been here, I've never seen that one. But that's one of the uh, chip shops I've never been to, but there are quite a few down here. And well, you're also... not allowed chips anymore, are you? I don't you're, eat you're chips. You're on a carb diet. I, I have um, no chips. I have just a bit of fish when I go in there. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a carb-free zone now, boys. Now, you know this area better than we do, surely. I've been here quite a few times, yes. Yeah, the trouble is, as we're walking nearer to the seafront, it's getting colder and more windier. So let's just show you Chip Pan Alley, folks. Oh, this is rare. Big, it? it makes you wonder how all these sort of I know, tacky open. shops stay open, don't they? Well, I've never been here. Didn't realise it was like this. Oh yeah. Oh hello. This is a nice one. Look, Kirk's. There we go. That's sort of a baker's, folks. I've never actually seen this one before. Butchers as well. And yeah, they do master stuff in there. Look, they've got a lovely butcher's counter over there as well. And also some lovely bakery stuff as well. Look, freshly made sandwiches. It's very nice in here. That's ne definitely not been here the last time I've been here. So yeah, that's a, that's a nice little delicatessen there. Oh, look at these pies. Yeah, look at these, look. Did you see them? <laughs> Let's have a look at them. How much are they? Four and, in actual Five fact, quid for that. that's, cheap, that, that's actually pretty cheap Sausage because... No, I'm happy with that. Yeah, because normally you, they're nine or ten pounds when you go to... Like, they look nice, eh? Hey? Other shops in London, for example, that's a, that's a good size pie, that as well, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, and they're oh, two pound forty nine steak and kidney pie. And yeah. how much are them big pork pies? You'll probably there? freeze them. Four forty nine. That's not bad. I've seen them for eight to ten pounds elsewhere, folks. So, or you can go to Morrison's three. I think it's three for a pound now. Yeah, but these are sort of uh, yeah, but they're nice ones. These these look like home cooked, don't they? As opposed to processed, you know. You've got the trading hub over there, which I gather is a cheap type of shop, isn't it? That sort of thing. Oh, just oh, Martin, oh, here we go. Oh, here we go. Oh, watches this channel. <laughs> here we go. How are you? All right, mate. Yeah. We're just filming I just, now. I just missed you at the um, <laughs> went for Sunday dinner down the rugged apron on when on Sunday. Oh, they did you? To, yeah, we did put a little note. Oh, I'm just saying hello to someone, folks. See you in a minute. Right, so we've made our way down to the seafront. And it seems like we're doing a tour of the local toilets. We're hanging around too many toilets, mate, aren't it's we? It's the second toilet we've been at. And uh, Dan obviously wants to go. And I didn't know, 40 pence now for a toilet in here. And you can't pay with a coin anymore. Yeah, card, don't you? You've got to pay with a card. And I, I ain't got a card on me, so I'll be knackered, wouldn't I? Yeah. Anyway, so we'll have a look at the sea in a minute, folks. It's very, very cold. The co near when we got to the seafront, the colder it is. He's all right. He's got a jacket on. Raven's got a fur coat. Yeah, I don't know how you do that. Wear shorts over here, mate. You do, don't you? Yeah. You're just a boy at art, aren't you? Man. Never grow up, it's a trap. Should we leave him here? Go and have a yeah, proper, proper walk about and have a bit of fun by ourselves. <laughs> leave him in the toilet. Yeah. He don't stop, does he? Yeah. He's bloody moaning again, All isn't he? All the time, moan, bloody moan, moan. moan about it being cold. He's supposed to be a bleating Yorkshire. travel troll. Yorkshire. Unbelievable. They call us bleating soft southerners. Yeah, we ain't, are we? We're roughy tufties. <sighs> Look, oh, there's a puddle. I'm not walking through puddle. Come on. <laughs> no, I'm not walking through puddle. Go on, off you go, Dan. No. Come on, Dan. My feet wet. You got your best creepers on. Come on, Dan. Look, JP, straight through it. No hassle. Look, no hassle. I thought I'd bring us down here, folks, because it's a bit bracing. Lovely. We can't go for a dip because we ain't got a lifeguard up there, Dan. We could have bought red shorts. We could have done a Baywatch thing. <laughs> And here, listen, look at this, folks, look. Do you remember the last time we was here? 
we've done a video here is all the rocks there's big boulders like you can just see over there the wind's blown all this up high now look wow that's amazing i've never seen this like this see them rocks there yeah, that's all they're here. all here all under there that's up, absolutely they? amazing there they must add sand to this no I, I, they do they do um level it out right. but it shifts it shifts yeah, like yeah. that look, just like that right. look like that. It's a nature thing. Not it's like what that. happens, not yeah. Like well, it depends, doesn't it? So I thought I'd bring it down here. Sometimes like that. I've never seen it go that way, Dan. It can go like that. It doesn't always go like that. Always that way. Always that way, because it's a, it's, it's a curve to the earth. I'm sure I've been here with Mazzy once it's before. I think it's the it wind like today. <laughs> it's because the, the earth's at a tilt, you see. Some and it always goes one way, way apparently. Anyway, yeah, I've shown you this. This is probably the highlight of our trip today. Yeah. I think we'll go down the pier in now. Before right. we get a pneumonia. Yeah, just to catch a bit more cold, and uh, we'll have a little walk along the jetty. Oh yeah, I love and that. I love we that are going to have a meal at some point today, which is going to be nice. Yeah, what are we having, Dan? We'll come with your chose. You pick the place. Um, we're not going to have any carbs. Mixed right. grill. Mixed we're grill. We're not going to have anything. Yeah, come on. Well, I'm talking about you lot now. Philly boost, Dan. I'm just going to have loads of everything. Yeah, I'm starving. Anyway, we're going to go now, folks, because he's starting to get on my nerves. <laughs> You can have to watch his video. It's the same the other way around when it's on these videos. So I'm not even do, doing one. Do today. check out his video. He's walked off with the amp again. I'm not look. even doing one today because I can't get a word in edgeways. He's done, he's done my Swedish already, look. <laughs> he's walked off with the amp, look. Look at his Oh, his little face, come on. come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come back in. Come on. Have a cut. Come on. Come on. Come on. All right, you'll be all right. You'll be all right. Go on, Phil, you're shaking. Oh, is that fear? I'm cold. Come. I didn't come to Skegness to come stand on. Do you, want to, do you want to ride on the donkey? Do you want to yeah. ride on the donkey? Well, yeah. We've got, we've got Raven. You get on the back of Raven, Dan. He's not having it, is he? Well, I was just saying, Dan, I brought you down here, but we walked straight past a bit of blinging history. Yeah? I What's love that? history. Well, well, if we look up there, look, just behind me. Oh, yeah. I wonder what they were for. It's just a very tall rubbish bin, isn't it? <sighs> it's a, bit like the it's a Roman spire, fortress. It's from Romans, I'm sure it was. What was that for? You must know, JP. You're a bit outdoorsy. Hey, no, I know. Go on in. I know Go all on. about these. Go on. Dan knows all about these. These are from Roman times. That's just a replica. What? Go on. What's but it what they used to do is start a fire way up in the sky. What? And they'd have another one as far as the eye can see. Oh yeah. And they would see the light from there. Yeah. And they'd start theirs. And what? then, as far as the eye could see, they'd start theirs. They'd so start roaming up here. If someone was coming to attack, oh yeah, right down there. What is Skeggy? Within 10 minutes, they'd know 50 miles away. Why don't they just build a lighthouse? I don't know. They've got all them wind farms out there. That's all. Oh, no. oh, your attitude, honestly. I was hoping for a bit of a history lesson there, but I don't think what he's saying is the truth. What were you saying? Uh, what were you sure saying? I've got them around Suffolk, around Suffolk and Essex. Yeah. Yeah. And what, yeah. what are they for, do you reckon? It's Roman times. No, what's it, it for? Oh, right, it's the Roman time. It's the Roman time, and also the highest fire. Oh, did you hear about that? The highest fire in the UK. It's, it's not Salisbury, in South, Salisbury, Salisbury, I know. Oh, he, he said that on your video, didn't you? You got slaughtered. That was AI. You got not slaughtered. Me. AI. 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 I've had to go wow, back and re-edit my video. Unbelievable. Because you said it as well, then, in your video. Yeah, because yeah, he told me. He told you. Sammy. He's relied on Britain Google, hasn't he? Sammy, give her a juice. She said, didn't she? She said Salisbury Cathedral. It's got the highest spire because it goes to the highest point in Wiltshire. No, she said she thought it was. Doesn't matter. History is a funny old thing. It can She's change just like that. History was written by right. the winners of wars. Did you know that? Yeah. History was written by the winners of. I can't even say it. The winners of war. <laughs> Your jaws freezing. Oh, it's so cold, and I'll, my hands. I can't let go of the bleeding phone. The, the camera <laughs> frozen around the camera. Come on, let's go somewhere oh, warmer. Yeah. So we thought we'd come with somewhere warmer. We've come for a bleeding ice cream stand. Look. Cream and a slush. Unbelievable. Pizza. You want a slush, puppy? I'll have an ice cream. Two cones for me. Anyway, we're going to walk on, folks, down the pier. Turn that off! <laughs> Right, we've come up to Skeggy now, just off of the uh, beaten track. We're where the B&M and Audi is, and we're going to try this place. We've never been in here before, me and Sharon. Dan and Maz has been in here. Well, uh, we all have. Oh, we, you've all we been in here. We came for a Christmas meal here this year. Oh, right, okay. Well, this is what it is, folks. <laughs> so 
So we've got a roast for 12 79 pizzas, you've got burgers, the whole lot there. In we go, it's a little five hygiene rating. Okay, baby. Visit, visit you for the toilets for the first time. Oh, yeah, Clean toilets. Oh, spotless, actually. Yeah. Spotless. And what have you had when you've been in here before? Christmas dinner. Cause Christmas, Christmas dinner. Stuff. Yeah, that's, that's the only time we've been in here. Unbelievable, isn't it? I, I don't listen, Sammy. I don't listen. Oh, I have to have the mixed grill. We've got the mixed grill. And they've got two sizes. They've got the mixed grill, 15.79, oh, yeah. and they've got the mega mixed grill, which is 21.29. Or they do a kebab meat as well, which is Donna meat. We don't want the chips for that, but it is an option. You're having a salad, Mazzy. Yeah. What, about, what about you, Sammy? You're having mac and cheese, aren't you? Mac and cheese. JP's toying with the idea of a um, mixed grill. grill. I think. Yeah, mixed grill. What, the small one, the normal one? 1579 would be enough, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's plenty there. And Dan wants uh, probably the mixed grill. Yeah, the fat boys one. Unless I'm getting one, I'm getting a big one. And he was talking about having a, shout, having a kebab on the side as well, Shout. Oh, no. Here's one thing for you folks. They do a dog's dinner in here as well. In other words, your dog can come in because it is a dog friendly place. And you've just bought a, a dog's dinner for £2.50. £2.50. Look at this, folks, though. He's just mixed it all. I'm mixing it up. He's just mixed it all up, but blowing it because it's hot. And it is hot as well. I really want to lick my fold. Of course you do. <laughs> <laughs> and, the, and the thing is, the dog's getting it fed. So nice. Before any of us look. <laughs> and he altered after. Oh look at and his little face. Thing, look in. Look. One thing you have to remember. He knows, he? All yeah. dogs are welcome, but the owners have to be well behaved. It says outside, <laughs> otherwise they can't come mm. in. You know what? I've never known that before, him. folks. Look, Dad's eating me dinner. Look. Oh, Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> what have you gone for there, Dan? What's that? It's something like the really hot Spicy man's burger. burger. Oh, man's looks, looks a good one, folks. Spicy. Look that, look. Beautiful. Regular. And one large. Oh, right, so yep. two. There we go. I've never seen a mixed grill like this before. <laughs> <laughs> that's the regular. That's mine, buddy. Oh, oh, did you order them separately? Lovely, yeah. thank you. That's your first. That yeah, I've got that. That's lovely. Is that everything? Lovely. Yeah, Shall yeah. went with a standard one without the chips on the onion rings and all that gear and the tomato and the mushrooms and the peas. Exactly the same with me, people. Look at that. Look. I do it every time. What's that? All the same. Then wish I'd had something else. <laughs> <laughs> and what you got in yours? You got the double burger there. Double stack burger with jalapenos and Looks jalapenos nice. and very skinny bacon. fries, aren't they? Nice skinny fries, lots skinny fries. And Sammy, what did you go for? Macaroni and cheese. Yeah, and you've gone with peas. Uh, garden peas on the side and also garlic bread. And Mazzy, what have you got there? Salad without anything. Without anything oh, on. Chicken salad. She took all the sauces off it. What was it? Bacon there, bacon on it. She took everything off. You're doing well, Mazzy. Yeah, like being shy, aren't you? Leave your stuff off. I'm being good. You are being good. <laughs> right, we're going to tuck in with this, folks, and we'll see you later on. Looks nice. Right, we're outside now, folks. That was absolutely lovely, I must say. As I say, I've never seen a place do a dinner for a dog before. So when you come here, you do expect the dog's dinner. Anyway, we're going to go back to the site now. I don't know what they've got planned. The girls oh, have been doing some shopping. I'm running in Mark's Spencer's. Hey? I'm running in Mark's Spencer's. Oh, yeah? Don't spend no money, Sharon, for God's sake. <laughs> oh, that one. That, oh, that one. We'll see you back at the site, folks. I don't know what's going on here now. fashion show we have <laughs> guest number one it gets number one ready for the fashion yeah. show yeah. come along 
al oír tu voz Algo en mí despertó que estaba dormido Algo en mí revivió I'm a fainted brother. So who brought what outfit? This was the last lot on the floor. Mine? <laughs> Do you know, got any idea who brought what outfit though? Yeah. Because you've matched them up perfectly. Right. Are they all separate? No, that's a set, that's a set, and that was a set. This is definitely Mazda got me this. She knows my taste. Oh dear. Sharon likes an old skirt. Is that yours, Sharon? Never wear a skirt, love. No. You like to see a skirt on the man. Can we say one's right and two are wrong? I'm right, aren't I? You're wrong. This is all Sharon. You're wrong. Well, You're right. Yay. JP's right. You got me this. Yeah. Well, thank you. <laughs> you seem you very happy. Actually, <laughs> well, I've brought up there with Matty. <laughs> you got it. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, it matches. It's Sorry, Matty. Right. right, but what I will say is we have to pick a winner as well because we said you've got to pick something retro. Out yeah. of the three, we're talking 1940s Cleveland. 1940s, yeah. <laughs> Ilda Ogden. Ilda Ogden. 1940s Grandma. Butcher. And a retro man. Thank this you. Is definitely the retro. That winner. is the retro. Look, I'll give him that. So Sharon, you are the winner. Thank you very Yay! much. Yay! Woo! Better get these up I think I've got to tell you folks what that was all about. The three girls went out and spent £10 each in Skeggy in charity shops to buy three outfits. We had to put them on and then we had to parade up and down like you've just seen. And the winner, the winner was the outfit that Sharon bought. Modelled by. Modelled by. Dan. And I said to him, actually it quite suits him. It's the pants. The pants he looks are retro. Fantastic. JP unfortunately looked like some washerwoman from the 1940s <laughs> and I said I got told that I look like being Pat Butcher. Hang so, on a minute, hang on a minute. Oh here we go, here this we go. This matches my pants. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, like, and yeah. actual fact, I think you're quite... Like 1960s it's Parisian not, artist. Yeah. <laughs> down, down the King's I Cross, the no, King hat. Street. King Street Hammersmith Sharon, it would have looked yeah. fantastic wouldn't it? Yeah. Quentin Crisp. Oh hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it actually fits him and suits him. How about that? that Can you nice. believe that is actually warm? Yeah, I know that's what she wears it for. Right, we're going to go now. <laughs> Raven's there. He's had a lovely Sunday roast on a, on a Friday, and we've had a good time today down by the seaside, having a bit of fun. Although it's been absolutely freezing. Sharon, is that you? Oh, you are over my shoulder, Sharon. Yeah, like of course you are. <laughs> so thanks very much for Dan and Mazzy. Uh, Sammy and also JP and Raven for inviting us around and we've had a bit of fun and we'll see you in the next video don't forget to go over and check out these guys uh, channels the links will be below in the description and uh, go and see the debacle over on the Travel Show <laughs> channel as well <laughs> terrible I don't know what they made us do it for sure the one thing you will find on our channel is oh, not the word debacle because neither of us know what it means <laughs> and that's the truth anyway thanks very much folks we'll see you in the next video and until then bye for now bye That's loud in my ear, Mazzy. <laughs> She's a screamer, Dan, isn't she? <laughs>